a blur of neon, steaming dumplings and the echoing clang of the ancient forbidden city bell. This is Beijing, a city where centuries-old history collides headfirst with the relentless energy of the modern world. 3,000 years of continuous habitation, folks. This city has seen empires rise and fall, witnessed revolutions and whispers of dynasties long gone. But beneath the weight of its past, Beijing pulsates with a raw, kinetic energy that's impossible to ignore. You wouldn't think a city like this, landlocked and steeped in ancient history, would have a beach scene. But Beijing, she likes to keep you guessing. Just a short hop from the city center, you'll find stretches of golden sand where the locals come to escape the urban chaos. Families picnicking, kids shrieking as they splash in the water, old men casting fishing lines into the surf. It's a side of Beijing you won't find in the guidebooks, a reminder that even in a metropolis of millions life finds a way to unwind. And let me tell you the seafood here is something else. Fresh from the Bohai Sea, grilled over charcoal, seasoned with nothing more than salt and chili flakes. Simple, honest food, the kind that makes you want to lick your fingers and order another round. This is the Beijing I'm starting to understand, a city of contrasts, a place where the ancient and the modern not only coexist, but thrive. Forget the tourist traps. If you want to taste the real Beijing, you need to get lost in the labyrinthine alleyways of the Hutongs. Here, in the heart of the city, generations-old recipes are passed down from grandmother to grandchild, the air thick with the aroma of spices and sizzling meat. We're talking dumplings, plump and juicy, filled with everything from pork and chives to delicate seafood. Noodles hand-pulled and tossed in savory sauces, each bite a symphony of texture and flavor. Peking duck, crispy-skinned and melt-in-your-mouth tender, a culinary masterpiece that's been perfected over centuries. This is food that nourishes the soul, food that tells a story, food that makes you want to close your eyes and savor every single bite. This is Beijing on a plate. The Forbidden City, even the name sends shivers down your spine. For centuries this sprawling complex of palaces and temples was the exclusive domain of emperors and their inner circle a place of unimaginable power and intrigue. Walking through these hallowed halls you can almost hear the ghosts of dynasties past, feel the weight of history pressing down on you. The intricate carvings, the vibrant colors, the sheer scale of it all, it's enough to make you feel like a peasant who's stumbled into a kingdom of giants. But there's beauty here too, the serenity of the imperial garden, the delicate artistry of the forbidden city's treasures, the quiet grandeur of a place that has stood for centuries as a symbol of China's enduring spirit. Forget your sterile shopping malls. In Beijing, the real action happens in the local markets. A riot of colors, smells and sounds, these bustling hubs of commerce are where you'll find everything from fresh produce and spices to clothing, electronics, and even live animals. The energy here is infectious. Vendors hawking their wares, shoppers haggling over prices, the constant hum of conversation and laughter, it's a sensory overload, a chaotic ballet of human interaction that leaves you breathless and exhilarated. This is where the soul of Beijing resides in the everyday rhythms of life, in the vibrant pulse of a city that never sleeps. In a city that moves at breakneck speed, the traditional tea ceremony offers a moment of quiet contemplation. More than just a drink, tea in China is an art form, a ritual that's been perfected over centuries. The delicate movements of the tea master, the fragrant steam rising from the porcelain cup, the bittersweet taste of the brew. It's a sensory experience that transports you to another time, another world. In this moment of shared tranquility, you connect not only with the ancient traditions of China, but with the people around you, sharing a moment of peace in the heart of the city. Forget your fireworks and parades. In Beijing, festivals are a way of life, a riot of color, sound, and tradition that explodes onto the streets with infectious energy. From the Lunar New Year, with its dragon dances and red envelopes, to the Lantern Festival, where the night sky is ablaze with a thousand twinkling lights, each celebration offers a unique glimpse into the soul of China, it's a chance to let loose, to lose yourself in the crowd, to experience the joy and exuberance of a culture that embraces life with open arms. Even in a city as densely populated as Beijing, there are pockets of tranquility to be found. The city's parks are a refuge from the urban chaos, a place where locals come to practice Tai Chi, play Mahjong, or simply enjoy a moment of peace amidst the greenery. Strolling through these urban oases you'll encounter a different side of Beijing. The quiet murmur of conversation, the gentle rustling of leaves, the laughter of children playing, it's a reminder that even in the heart of a metropolis, life finds a way to bloom. These parks are the lungs of the city, a breath of fresh air in the urban jungle. When the sun sets, Beijing transforms into a city of neon and excitement. From the trendy bars and clubs of San Litun to the traditional tea houses and karaoke joints of the Hutongs, there's something for everyone in this city that never sleeps. Whether you're looking to dance the night away, sip cocktails with a view, or belt out your favorite tunes with a group of friends, 
Beijing's nightlife scene is as diverse and dynamic as the city itself. So put on your dancing shoes, grab a drink, and get ready to experience the city that never sleeps. Beijing's art scene is a vibrant tapestry of tradition and innovation. From the ancient scrolls and calligraphy of the past, to the bold, experimental works of contemporary artists, the city's galleries offer a fascinating glimpse into the evolution of Chinese art. Walking through these spaces, you'll encounter a world of color, texture, and emotion, a reflection of the complexities and contradictions of modern China. From the politically charged to the whimsically abstract, Beijing's art scene is a testament to the enduring power of creativity, a reminder that even in a rapidly changing world, art continues to challenge, provoke, and inspire. As the sun dips below the horizon casting a golden glow over the city, Beijing's skyline takes on a magical quality. The towering skyscrapers, the ancient temples, the sprawling hutongs, all bathed in the warm light of sunset, a breathtaking panorama that captures the essence of this extraordinary city. This is Beijing, a city of contrasts, a city of history, a city of dreams, a place where the ancient and the modern collide, where tradition and innovation coexist, where the past whispers to the present, and the future unfolds before your eyes. This is a city that stays with you long after you've left. A city that lingers in your memory. A city that beckons you back again and again. So there you have it. Beijing, a city that kicks your ass and steals your heart all in the same breath. You want ancient history? Check. You want cutting-edge futuristic madness? Check. You want dumplings that'll make you weep tears of joy? Double check. This city is a goddamn feast for the senses, a place that will challenge your preconceptions and leave you wanting more. I've only scratched the surface here, folks. This city is a bottomless well of experiences, a place that demands to be explored, savored, and understood. But you gotta be open to it, open to the chaos, the beauty, the contradictions, open to the fact that you'll never truly get Beijing, but that's okay, that's part of the allure. So come hungry, come curious, and come ready for one hell of a ride. Beijing's waiting.